Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. Well, pretty Ricky Baby Blue, <laughs> he turns himself in on Monday. Um, he for the for the you know the loan thing, uh, but he's blaming everybody else. He said, honestly, the informants in my case maybe their scapegoat. Made it seem like uh, we were a part of the scam, but in reality, they scammed me and other celebs. They told us lies. Wrongly con uh, convicting, vic I'm sorry, wrongly convicting victims. Unfortunately, being naive isn't a defense in court of law. You think I'm going to miss my chance at being a real guy by telling? <laughs> Listen, this is what happened. Everyone was trying to do this in the beginning of everything. People called me and they were like, yo, you should do it, man. It's free money, bro. I was like, nah, I'm good. Because nothing's free, man. Nothing's free. Everything comes with a price, okay? And all these people are getting messed up now. It's not free money. You you, you, you fill out what you want on these forms, it's going to come back to you. And some people went way overboard. I mean, look, I, I'll get to that in a second. Uh, baby, look, look at this guy, okay? Look. He wanted to stunt, man. Look at the chains he was buying. Look at that chain. He was stunting. Look at that. Huge chains with big charms. Different chains. Holding money to his head. This guy was living life. Okay? You you went for the quick thing, quick, quick scam to, you know, get some money and, you know, stunt on everybody else, but uh it didn't work out. Now, some people get away with it. Some people don't. I don't know. Turns himself in on February 7th. Then we got Nicki Minaj. Well, she made up with the City Girls. Okay. I just had a great combo with the girl JT and young Miami 305. Let's move on and make new memories. They probably call Grovelin. Okay. Listen, this is what really happened. They were down with QC. Still are. But they were down with QC hard in the beginning. Doing tracks with Cardi B. Cardi B and Nicki had their little tiff, right? And they chose a side. That's what happened, okay? And maybe that's what that conversation was about tonight. Maybe it was about, hey, we got caught up in the middle of this, and we were just trying to get on, but we're, we're big fans, and da-da-da-da-da, you know? And, you know, why hold a grudge? You know, you can let bygones be bygones. You can let it be what it is. You don't got, you know, you can move on. You know, you don't got to be angry. So, JT said, Sag, Sag, sister, thank you for your time and advice. True queen, love you. And they're following each other now. Drake unfollows Rihanna as well. He follow, unfollowed ASAP Rocky when the news came out that, you know, Rihanna got pregnant. Now he unfollowed Rihanna. I'm sure it's painful. I mean, you know. You didn't uh, take it seriously with Rihanna, and now you got to watch her have a baby with somebody else and build a life with somebody else. But it, it hurts. It hurts. You know, you got to, if you find someone special, you got to like make the effort. That's all I got to say. All right. Um, then we got Young Buck. He's kind of like acting, now he's acting like an emotional female. No offense to any females out there. But, uh, you know, went to his ex-girl's house, vandalized property, got arrested. All right. Young Buck's making a fool of himself. According to the arrest warrant, domestic disturbance involving 40-year-old David Darnell Brown on Rockland Trail. Uh, authorities said Brown's ex-girlfriend reported early Wednesday morning. Brown texted her and said he was going to come over. When he eventually arrived at her home, Brown began kicking in the front door because she did not answer. The affidavit then went on to say Brown's ex-girlfriend told officers that she had cameras on her home. When she noticed Brown had left, she went outside and saw that he had kicked and damaged both passenger and driver's side. The vehicle sitting in the driveway. Dude, you're going out bad, my G. Move on. Alrighty, man. Well, that's about it. Drake. <laughs> Come on, bro. Uh, anyways, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button. I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.